At the Foundation, we've realized that trust is at the center of what makes healthcare work. And we also have realized that many of us in healthcare put our faith in our science. We think the reason patients come to us, the reason patients rely on us, is because of the quality and integrity of our methods. But actually, we believe in the current world, and maybe for a long time, it's the relationships that individuals and institutions have with the people they serve that make healthcare work. We think it's been neglected, and we are interested in creating a vanguard community of people who are focusing on the idea of building trust and becoming trustworthy as a core strategy for success. We think it's really important for healthcare organizations and the people in them to take some time to focus explicitly on building trust with the communities and individuals they serve. Why do we think that's so important? Well, if we think that the reason people are coming to us is because we have the cutting edge technology or because we have the doctors who've published the latest journal articles, that's certainly important for the brand of any academic health center and certainly community hospitals are interested in conveying to the communities they serve that they have state-of-the-art technology and state-of-the-art services. But something that often gets lost in that is this idea of trust. In healthcare, we often assume that our patients and communities trust us. But the reality is that lots of communities have reasons to mistrust and distrust the healthcare organizations that purport to serve them. And we often act in ways that send a message that we care more about our own situation than we do about theirs. So we think the intentional strategy of building trust is a critical strategy for being successful at delivering high quality healthcare. We also think it's a critical piece in health equity. We know that there are black and brown populations in this country who not only historically have not been well served, but are currently not being well served right now. One need look no further than the disparate outcomes from COVID in this country with death and hospitalization to realize that communities of color can take a look and say, wait a minute, these systems are not committed to serving me. And if we're going to close gaps in health equity, we're going to have to address issues of earned mistrust. We're going to have to engage in strategies that intentionally build trust. Visit buildingtrust.org to learn more.